This video explains how you can view the HTTP request headers request body, then response headers response body in Fiddler. So once you start capturing the traffic on the left hand side, it will display all the uh, URLs that you have accessed or the resources that you have loaded over the internet. So to see the details of that particular request, you have to double click on that. On the, uh, once you double click on the right hand side, you will see these details. So on the top side, it will show the request details and the uh, bottom side, it shows the response details. So in the top uh, side, there is a headers tab, which shows the headers of the request. So here you can see that uh, there are these many headers, cache, client, and cookies, security transport, these headers were sent. If you want to see if uh, there is any body, since it is a get request, there will not be any body, but if it is a post request, uh, you can uh, see the body over there in the text view, or you can also see the raw details. Since it is get request, there is no uh, request body, it is just the headers. Or if you are sending the JSON payload, you can see that over there. So this is about the request and the, once you get the response from the server, you can see that response over there. Right now you can see that the response is showing some gibberish characters. If you want to see the actual characters, you can uh, in, uh, decode that by clicking here and it will show the actual uh, data that was sent. So server can send image based upon the request actually, what kind of uh, resource you are requesting. If it is image, you can uh, see that in image view. So since it is not an image, it was text HTML document. So it is, and the image is not showing anything. But if you are uh, requesting the image, it will show here. If you are requesting JSON data, then JSON will be shown. XML will be shown here. If it is raw, it will be shown here. So raw will show you the headers as well as the actual uh, body response body as well. So this is very useful. Like uh, also cookies, you can see here. So it's very useful if you are a web developer, it, you can uh, see what actual data is being uh, sent and received through the server. Thanks for watching this video.